Yo, what's going on guys? So, here I have an IQ navigation, AI laser vision, and I have a Shark AI. So, right here, Shark Robotic Model AV970, Shark RV2000. This is technically still an IQ series. This is modeled after the IQ series, but AI. This is just a smart version of the IQ. But in today's video, we're going to be talking about the error codes that you're going to get on these particular machines. Now, these error codes can change dependent on exactly what model you have, but this is a good rule of thumb. <clears throat> and pardon me if I clear my throat. Um, a clear red plus exclamation red flashing, suction motor failure, remove an empty dustbin, clean filter, remove blockage. A clean red flashing will indicate the robot may be stuck on an obstacle. Move robot to new location on level surface. Dock red flashing. Front bumper may be jammed. Clean bumper and make sure it move, uh, moves in and out freely. The clean is white, but the dock is red solid. Bound, uh, bot boundary error. Move your bot to a flat surface away from the magnetic boundary strip. If you don't know what they're talking about there, let me grab one. Not everybody has these, not everybody gets them, but this is a magnetic strip. I'll leave a link in the description for this. They're very handy to have. You only need a couple laying around and it solves a lot of headaches. Um, the most notorious issue, the clean is red and the dock is white flashing. Cliff sensor error, move robot to new location, clean sensors. If you get this error, error number seven, error number 13 or number three, um, which depending on what robot you have, those are the numbers that will say you might as well take this thing and buy another one, warranty it, or hope you can fix it yourself because the cliff sensor errors on the IQ and the AI are a nightmare. And it's generally because the robot ran over pee or poop and got cleaned inappropriately. The sensors cannot tolerate any moisture whatsoever besides 91% isopropyl alcohol with no battery installed and clean air dried for at least four hours. All right, uh, we got a clean red and a dock red flashing. Dust bin needs to be removed and reinserted. Dock red plus exclamation red flashing. Side brush is stuck. I don't really see that one very often. Uh, clean red plus dock red plus exclamation red flashing. A drive wheel is stuck, clean wheel. This happens whenever it runs over socks or anything like that. Next, we have clean is white, exclamation is red, flashing. Blockage and bl brush roller remove any debris from the brush roller. So these do have an over overheating sensor on their motors now. This one's not. This is an old school one. But that was the main failure on these is they were overheating and melting because they'd run over something. Uh, red, uh, red clean, dock white, exclamation mark, flashing, red. Doc has encountered an error while booting. Please turn off and on again. Then we got clean white plus dock red flashing. Robot cannot locate dock. Please pick up your robot and place it on the dock. That one happens from time to time when it loses sight. You might want to clean it. Clean the front, clean the top. Should be good to go. Also make sure you clean the charger. Battery icon red flashing. Battery is critically low, needs recharging. If your robot is unable to dock, place your robot on manually. It's a very good one. Next is Clean red, dock white, plus exclamation mark red, robot is, robot is stuck, move to level surface. These are the most common ones. If you want to pause this video at any second while you're seeing this, you can check these out. If you have any questions, guys, feel free to comment below. I'll try to answer as many as I can, but I know that this post will be blown up by people asking the same thing over and over, so also check comments. But with that being said, guys, I appreciate everything y'all do. Make sure you subscribe for more videos. If you have any questions, comment below. If you're looking for a product or any parts, go ahead and check that description. Thanks for watching.